This is going to be a how to remove a door panel on a 2014 Chevy Corvette. I'm going to start on the passenger side here. And the driver's side is similar, but it has one extra bolt that you got to remove. I'll go ahead and show you the passenger side first. Again, this is a 2014 60th anniversary Chevy Corvette. Okay, I'm going to use a Torx T30 bit. Power drill here. There's going to be one little groove that's underneath this handle, comes straight down on this passenger door. There's one Torx bolt in there. Um, I loosened it. it, it ain't gonna fall out on this side. The other side it will come out, but this side it kind of stays wedged up in there. So after that, I'm gonna use just a standard plastic panel popper. And right underneath this red reflector, there's a groove right here. You can get this up in there and start prying. It's a good starting point. I'm gonna go ahead and change sides here. I start and it'll sound like you're breaking it pretty good but these things have really good clips in them so let's pry it up all the way if you can get your finger underneath it try to help out and just work this on both sides once you get so far on one side you might have to stop and start going the other way trade sides here again if you get your hand under here Try to help wedge it out. Usually goes pretty fast in that way. Don't be afraid to yank on it. Get up in here to the inside. Again, these plastic panels work really good. I would really recommend using a flathead screwdriver. You will damage this material, but you can scratch the paint, of course. This plastic panel popper makes it so you don't do any kind of scratches or gouges in the material of the door. Get that all the way up on that side. And then I'll come back over here. Try to finish this side a little bit. You gotta be careful. There's nothing to pop the holds these. Oh, there's that bolt. The bolt just fell out. It's just a T30 with aluminum bolt. Once you get to the top of this, you gotta start being careful because the whole door skin might jump out at you. Again, I'm making this video because I couldn't find anything on this car so I just came to the realization here there's a bolt must be back behind here I'm getting a lot of uh, strong point here when I'm trying to pry it so I'm gonna take a real fine pick tool try to get this out just a basic clip and actually I did find another torx bit back here let me go ahead and show you one more torx bit back there all right like i said once that bolt's removed i mentioned that the door skin will just jump out at you and it just falls off as long as all the tabs are removed you just got this one main clip right here you just squeeze the two black tabs on the outside the blue swings up around and it unplugs and the entire door skin will come straight off i'm doing this one-handed here but i'm gonna try to show you you just squeeze these in swing this blue up and it'll pop right off. The entire door's gonna come right off. Everything else is went. Everything else goes right through that little harness right there. Then you expose the 10 inch Bose speaker if you need to service it or anything like that. And that's how you get the door panel off of a 2014 Chevy Corvette. Real quick, like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, the driver's side door is going to be the exact same thing, except for you don't have to remove this button like we did on the other side because there's no bolt behind this. There's actually a little panel right here. You pop it off with the panel pick tool, 
or the panel popper. And uh, right behind here is two of those T30 bits. And that'll let you get this door skin off if you need to just pry it off like the other side. Same thing, careful it might jump out at you. But there's only two bolts to these doors and then just pop right off. So, enjoy. Thanks for watching.